Trials of driverless cars are to go ahead in South Australia in November. The trials will be strictly quarantined from regular traffic to learn how best to adapt to Australia's driving habits and climate. Google have been leading the research into this new technology in the United States. The terrible tragedy of America is 30,000 people die on the highways every year. So can you imagine if we could, with automation and self-driving cars or automatic driving cars, if we could cut that number in half or to a third, that's a serious improvement in quality of life. Driverless cars have been tested on Californian roads for a number of years. Recently, someone was injured in a collision. Google cars have been the victims of 14 small accidents since they initially deployed in 2009. 11 of them have been rear-enders, the most recent of which being the one that took place on July 1st. According to the data, the car was struck from behind by a human driver going 17 miles per hour. According to Google, this was down to human error, justifying their belief that computers are better drivers than people.